Greetings, beautiful energy. Welcome into your tarot messages. Thanks for tuning in. These are messages of money for Zodiac Stain Cancerian, and I hope you find some that resonates with you. View these messages as your entertainment, and let's get started. So, something going on with your money having to do with uh, family or loved ones, or someone feeling loss or sadness. Okay. Um, someone may be feeling stressed out, like they're dealing with a lot, or they have to deal with a lot, or they were dealing with a lot. Someone could be crying. I'm also seeing where, whatever, if someone thought they had you under their oppression, like you outsmarted that, and you've come out like on top. With the chariot energy. Mm hmm. You have um, outsmarted something that was supposed to like get you caught. You were supposed to be caught up in something, but you outplayed it. You didn't get tied up into something because you're really skillful. Um, you outplayed it. You've outdone it. This is a person or a situation, and so like natural, you're naturally skillful. I'm also getting the wind. Or someone being swift or quick thinking. Yeah, something was supposed to like also make you feel tired, drained, stressed out, without, and all of these things. But you quickly outsmarted it. I guess you quickly like, yeah. If you had like an enemy or something, the knight, the king of wands. Um, I hear a friend, a friend or a friend enemy. Someone that was really um heftily jealous. Um, this could be about a relationship and so they wanted to become like they wanted to go against you. Okay. So this is someone close in some way. Or you thought that they were close. Yeah, the twelve cups. Um I feel like a friend. So the twelve cups and the twin flames. And this has to do with money as well. Like someone wanted your money or they wanted your place. Okay. Queen of Cups, Four of Diamonds, Two of Wands. Someone wanted to be in your place. Chakra. Someone wanted to be awake like you. Full card. For real. So either you, you're a broadcaster or something. You're a channeler, a messenger. You're, not, you're a gifter. You may be into food delivery services for work. All right, then someone wanted to like take your place, okay? Um, okay, justice and the and the hermit card, but it did not happen. Okay, it just did not happen. Empress, you stayed firm, you stayed grounded and strong. Yeah, someone thought that they could um trigger you, or someone thought that they could get manipulate you because like they thought you didn't know yourself, you weren't self aware, so they could come and tell you one thing. And then you would like give up yourself for them or something, but they were wrong. You are you like you know your worth. You know yourself. So there's a um a spell that is being broken, a cycle that is really over right now because like you chose yourself. You know. So imagine you there was this test. Imagine there was a test that came up. And you outsmarted, outdid this test. And because of that, there's a celebration. You did, and you did this just in time. It's reminding me of when Dora and Boots figure something out just in time before a Swiper comes, right? And um, then it, we are all celebrating because it was tense at first, but you figured out something on time. And so you broke the, the spell, you stopped the, you stopped the person that was trying to come at you. This is the Tower card and the World card. Like I'm feeling like you successfully removed something. You successfully overcame a test. You successfully protected yourself. Okay. And you're moving up. Yeah. So you all want some type of an enemy or some nemesis or something like that. Five of Swords. Yes. Three of Cups. You're re and you're, you're being celebrated or you're celebrating. Okay. You've won, I feel like, is the energy. I was saying that too in a love message. Someone just, I feel, death card. Someone was wrong about you and the Queen of Cups. Someone thought that 
you wouldn't have won. So it's the energy where you win and you're you're taking your you're getting your credits and someone just really thought that you did not have something in you. Like someone thought they knew you. That's what I'm telling you. And this could be about your the truth that you speak, how you believe in yourself. Mm -hmm. Some so I'm guessing like someone learned that you are more than what they thought. Okay. You actually have a grounding, you have standing, you have family, you have faith, you have gifts, you know, you have good ideas. There's someone you that was being kept waiting or something that is going to be pushed forward now that you have successfully overcome a tribulation, right? Yeah, this is being pushed forward now. You're gonna you're gonna successfully work with someone else, align with someone else that is further liberating you. Say say this is imagine this is one of those movies and someone like going really hard to get their freedom, and so they were being re they were being stopped, they were being prevented from getting something like a piece of paper, a word, a document, or something. Um, even though it was owed to them, it was they earned it, you know, so. You end up getting, so imagine this person in the movie end up after struggling and fighting and stressing, they end up getting what they were supposed to get coming out of the, the battle, right? So you were going through a spiritual battle as well, clearing your name, people talking against you, all of this. <laughs> His, um, humiliation, disgrace, slant, you went through a lot of things, right? Where you had to defend yourself, protect yourself say no that was not me because people were trying to put you in things and you're like no you had to speak up defend yourself everything right because you were listen you said you wanted your freedom and someone was not gonna make it easy or because they just did not want you to have that i guess they wanted your freedom more than you but this is something that you believed in and so like after you get that redemption you get your paperwork or whatever the next step is to go forth now, right? This is the energy of when, so imagine Charlie, when he just got the golden ticket. So imagine all the stress that he had to go through to get the ticket. Then maybe someone, after he got his golden ticket, you know, to go toward his dream. So this is someone's, your, this is your dream we're talking about, your vision, your accomplishment, your liberation, your success, your financial freedom, abundance for generations, breaking generational curses. You said you wanted to do it. This is your vision. You said you wanted to do, you know, whatever this great accomplishment is. Maybe you want to have family. You want to get married. But this is a love reading. So you had to, like, prove yourself. You had to save your money. You had to be disciplined. You had to hold out. You've, you've just, you, you did what you said you were going to do. You had to work hard, invest in yourself, um, build yourself up, even work yourself out to get this golden ticket so that you can go further to like when Charlie finally gets to go to the chocolate factory it's like the beginning of your new journey now but you had to go through a lot with someone imagine after Charlie got his golden ticket someone after he went through a lot you know he saved up for it he sacrificed for it all kind of things you know and then someone wanted to take it from him at the end and he had to like go against that person he had to stand up against that person too to keep his his own freedom ticket his own golden ticket to the chocolate factory okay um so that's what you've been through so now it's on to the greater things is how i'm feeling like all right magnificent energies you are it's just that you should know you are triumphant and your angels you were not alone because you had people that believed in you supporting you family friends exes and people that you you were you probably didn't even know that were like pushing you forward, mm -hmm. and the energy that supported you could be an energy that knows both you and the other person and doesn't choose to help you, cause you are like you are justice is on your side. So I guess someone like betrayed another person to help you is the energy, yeah, because you they wanted to see you go for it. So yeah, six of cups energy, and like some, they may have even been like trying to team up against you, and then one person decided to stop, 
and like give you way so there are some people that are angry upset in some way shape or form that some they feel like someone betrayed them or sold them out and delayed them so that you could succeed and win and blossom and rise up yeah but the three diamonds is like we're telling the truth like you're gonna get your recognition i'm seeing a lot of compliments and gifts talents coming your way um a lot of like a lot being released like your pentacles ching -ling -ling. like after they've you know when you something was on hold but then you you work hard for it and you got it it's reminding but something was sacrificed as well because it's reminding me of the the energy of squid games where each when each player gets eliminated it adds to the pile of money so that's the energy like you've successfully unlocked something or accomplished something that is releasing more pentacles more opportunities you may be a model you may be an artist right you spoke the truth because and someone just thought that they would have gotten away with it yeah there and there's something about your dreams someone thought that they knew more magic than you like someone thought that they could slow, throw whatever they're throwing at you your way and it would slow you down but they didn't realize that they would like be tiring themselves out using so much of their energy like they didn't realize that right to go like someone just didn't realize how strong you are and how much of their energy and resources it would have taken to try to go against you because they didn't know how determined you are how focused like how hungry you were for for this success that you your whatever your vision is now this person is like whoa whoa whoa, whoa. so like that's what they're saying to you now they're getting to see how 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 <laughs> How much you're holding on to what is yours. How much you'd like. You're like vicious for what is yours. Yeah. That's the energy. Someone is like don't bite my hand off. Like cool it. Calm it. Yeah but this person. You have a right to not trust them with those doggy instincts. Because that's what they were coming for. So if you were sharp with someone. And you cut them off. Or you spoke some truth. You stood up for yourself. That you were right to do so. The ju judgment card. Someone may have been judging someone as wicked. There's something about um, a popular celebrity. I'm not going to say her name. Um, maybe something about her family as well. Okay. Judgment card. Yeah, you're getting a new beginning. And that you are also being watched. J judgment card is most high energy. And authenticity and real. Like you're getting recognition as a true person, a real person, the, like a good person. Because I feel like the person you were going up, that was going up against you, there was some type of a match. Like whether you are the good one, who is telling the lie, who is telling the truth, who is the good one, who is not the good one. I feel like, so imagine um, this is a test of life. Who really is genuinely the good person? Who goes out there and give? Who who should really be queen? Or You know what I'm saying? Who should really get this seat? Who should really be the queen or the king? Oh my gosh, going back to the chocolate factory. Who is the real one? Who is going to last to the end? Who is the real good one? I feel it for true. So you've been being watched, right? With the six head cups and the king of diamonds and people are seeing that there is so much good there is goodness in you people angels spirits guides whatever right the higher ups the authorities they're seeing that there's goodness in you and someone is speaking up on your behalf someone is defending you justice someone is i could be a capricorn or here daddy police someone is really speaking up uh, for you and i'm like it's making someone else upset because they thought that this person would would, would want to go against you <laughs> you know so they're like oh you're you're good you're, you're not on my side so let us say this is someone's someone a father and a daughter and the daughter was trying to go against you but her father sees the goodness in you and is speaking up for you and so this daughter is like oh oh my <laughs> You know, she's like, you're my father. You should be on my side. But this person is a just person. It could be a judge. A fair person. A fair ruling is taking place. Someone is not going to be able to torment you, bully you into like, because they have some type of authority or, or they thought that they had close relationships to people who would want to, to be on their side and get, 
but they didn't realize that the energy on your side is like God, you have kings on your side. You hear me even if you can't see them. So anyone that is supporting you realizes that, listen, you have kingdom energy on your side. You're royal, you're glorious, you're protected, you're in the right, right? <laughs> Believe you me. Christ energy, Christ consciousness. Someone is seeing that you know what you are doing. Someone is seeing that you are equipped. You are fit for the race. You're naturally talented. This is your this is a position, judgment that you should be in. But like someone was vexed because like I keep repeating the same thing. Like this person was vexed. Competition and a challenge. Something also about here. It's page of that and page of wands. And I'm getting family energy. <laughs> 